Have you ever wondered that you have been an antagonist in another person's life? Or the person whom you love has become an antagonist to you? Or even another antagonist could have come and messed things up in relationships and in your life where walking away was the only answer. You have tried every method to ease the pain, even an empty bottle till the last drop seems like it's not enough at all. And yet, in the dark, we ruminate. Ruminate about the past, regrets of why haven't I acted accordingly when I have the chance? Why haven't I say words when I have the chance? And right now, you're living underwater just because of the antagonist, just because he caused the mess and you're left alone to deal with it. Well, we have time, time to change. It's good to seek help from above, to surrender our lives. It is good to seek someone whom you can trust, trust to pray, to intervene and speak to you. You could go back to your sports and be active back again. You could play the piano your talent you could sharpen your skills because that's who you are you can sit down in front of the TV and go all day watching series to learn how other people deal with sufferings caused by antagonists you could call your friends over and watch a good football man. They will cheer you up and there is no regret because they are on your side and they are there beside you to cheer you up. It may take two years, three years or more for the pain to ease. Yet you have created many memories in that three years. The feeling of hatred, pain, revenge, utter disappointment may ease if you step up and no longer belong there. Then you will see that hey, life is good. It is good to remember that some people come in our lives as blessings, some come in your life as lessons, which was once said by Mother Teresa. And it is good to be reminded that he has made everything beautiful in its time.